Hello everybody, Ben Davis here, and today I've got a brief tutorial on how to create a tricoupled dock that is connected at launch. I'll start by creating our tricoupled dock the way you'd expect. A tricoupler with a trio docking ports connected, more ports connected to those, and a tricoupler to cap the bottom. For the initial test, I set up the arrangement to hang from a launch stabilizer, and everything appears to be working as expected. But our issue is exposed when I add some weight to the bottom and try hanging the assembly again. Only one of the docking ports is actually connected to the bottom tricoupler. The solution to that problem is to ensure that the docking ports are connected to the tricoupler directly. I create an assembly where one of the docking ports is the root or base part, add the tricoupler and the additional ports. Now the problem is that the docking ports aren't connecting to each other because they're being pulled apart before they can dock. Okay, so instead of hanging the assembly, let's allow it to just sit on the launch pad. That should give the docking ports a chance to connect. To test, I'll add a really simple rocket above the ports. That's looking better. Now all three docking ports are connected. The one that's connected in the VAB can be decoupled, releasing all three ports, or the other two can be undocked individually. But there's a slight problem that's barely visible in the video. The rocket above the tricoupler sits at a slight angle. What's the solution? As always in KSP, more struts. The struts will disconnect when the master docking port is decoupled instead of being undocked. Now we've got a strong and stable tricoupled docking node using only stock parts that's connected on the launch pad. I hope you enjoyed my little video and happy docking.